Round one of the CIMB Classic was chock full of eagles and none better than this one from Scott Brown. Oh, how about that? Welcome to The Takeaway, I'm Amanda Balionis. Things are underway at the CIMB Classic in Kuala Lumpur and jet lag, well that was not an issue as these guys went low and made eagles look like the easiest commodity on the course. We'll start with the biggest highlight of the day. Scott Brown, who aced the 199-yard par 3 15th, rattled the flagstick. First eagle. And it's a hole in one here at 15. He'll be taking home this sweet BMW for that perfect swing. Not bad for a day's work. Brown was far from the only player having fun on Thursday. Check out Jason Duffner making this 40-footer on the fifth for eagle, giving the enthusiastic fist pump to his local caddy this week. The fifth hole seemed to have a magnet in the bottom of the cup. Adam Scott seemed more than comfortable with his putter when he eagled the fifth from 45 feet out. Ball had a little speed on it. It was slammed into the back of the hole. Keegan Bradley also got it going with a huge eagle on the same hole. And that's how you do it. He's six under par, four off the lead. And we're not done yet. Daniel Summerhays added to the big bird madness on that fifth hole with a 70 footer that found the bottom of the cup. Now, after all those eagles, the PGA Tour Twitter account posed the question, who isn't making eagle on number five? Well, Justin Thomas had that answer. Thomas responded to the tweet saying, I made six, John Peterson made a six, and Daniel Berger made a nine. So us is the answer to that question. He's four under par after 18 holes. In an effort to show you more than just two holes on the golf course, check out Hideki Matsuyama's chip in for birdie on 12. And let's end this with leader Scott Piercy's final birdie of the day to take a three-shot lead thanks to an incredible opening 10 under 62. Piercy may not have had an eagle on the card, but 10 birdies and no-drop shots, well, that'll work every time. All right, you're now caught up with all of the must-see shots from day one in KL. I'll see you after round two.